Kirin 960 Chus had announced much faster GPU, better power use. High Silicon unveiled the new Kirin 960 chipset, which puts the Huawei own chip maker a step ahead of the competition. With a Huawei Mate 9 around the corner, you have to wonder how long we'll wait before we see a 960 powered device. The new chipset is built on a 16 nanometers FinF ET process by TSMC like the 955 before it, but uses newer parts. The octa-core processor now has four Cortex-A73 cores forming the powerful half-balance by four Cortex-A53 cores. High Silicon is promising a 15% performance boost, also the A73 promises sustained performance thanks to power savings compared to the A72 less heat equal less throttling. The Kirin 960 will be among the first chips to use ARM's new Bifrost GPU. The Mali G71 promises reduced power use compared to the T880 used in Kirin 955, Exynos 8, Helio 1025 and others. Also, High Silicon put 8 GPU cores, up from the 4 it used on its previous high-end chipset. In total, this leads to a massive 180% jump in performance coupled with 20% power savings. The new chipset has more to offer as well. It supports UFS 2.1 for blazing fast flash storage, LPDDR4 RAM and an LTE CAT 12 13 modem up to 600 Mbps down, 150 Mbps up. CDMA is also supported for markets like China and the US. The ISP is also upgraded for improved image quality.